How to join Etsy teams to generate traffic and income. First, you're going to sign in with your username and password. Next, you're going to go where it says you, your teams. And then you'll see a list of teams here that I'm a part of. Um, you can always create teams and search for different teams for whatever you're selling. We sell vintage clothing, so we're part of Team Vintage, Vintage, Increased Sales, and so on and so forth. For this tutorial, I'm going to use the Favorites for Sales team. The more favorites and views you have on your items, the more likely your item is to sell. I like to post in this thread where you post one and heart 40. Make sure you follow all of the rules and guidelines of the team because they can kick you out. Next, you're going to post a reply with whatever listing you want to be promoted. I'm going to switch between screens here and go to View Shop, pick a listing that I want, and then you're going to go up into your search browser and copy that link, switch back to the other browser, and paste it. There, your item will be shown, and you have to favorite or heart 40 items before you. When you get to an item that already has a heart, you have to unheart it and heart it again. You're going to continue this until you've heart all 40 items. So to sum it up, it's important to post to Etsy teams because it gives you more visibility. It also, the more likes and the more hearts and views that you get for your item, it'll rank higher in the search engine for Etsy and also in Google. Um, the more your product gets seen, the more likely it is to be bought. Also, when you're posting to these teams, um, it gives people an opportunity to see what you have to sell and maybe they want it. So there is no harm to posting to Etsy teams. It'll only be beneficial. And once you've gained a customer base and you have enough followers, then you can just kind of sit back and relax and watch the money rolling.